So I got my start in the electrical industry in 2001 when I was 19 years old. I applied to this program, unsure of where it was gonna take me. I had no idea I would be here today. We finally made it. We finally are out of our old building and we're getting this new building set up. My name is Jeff Arns and I'm the training director for the apprenticeship program for Columbia Basin Electrical Training Alliance in Kennewick, Washington. Today is an special day. This is the culmination of years worth of work from the JATC committee, both in planning, procuring the funds, and then executing the construction of this building to get us to where we are today. As a testament to the century-long collaborative partnership between NECA and the IBEW, Kennewick, Washington celebrated the opening of the Columbia Basin Electrical Training Alliance. This cutting-edge project is dedicated to advancing electrical training. It is more than just a building. It represents the future of electrical training in the Columbia Basin region. Our local covers two states, Oregon and Washington. We're domiciled here in Kennewick, Washington, but we cover eight counties in southeast Washington and eight counties in northeast Oregon. It's just important for the community, for the, for the youth coming up. We gotta have a, a, a better facility. IBW has the best program on the planet, no doubt. We have to have the facilities to be able to do it as well. And that's what this new facility is gonna do for us. This facility will be able to turn out a vastly more educated apprentice uh, than others of its kind for the exploding work picture that we have going forward, especially considering the fact that we have a heavy investment within the data center world and the advent of AI is just taking that and multiplying the job picture on an inflationary level. Uh, and the ability to maintain the production of those projects along with what the customer's needs are is paramount. Within these walls lies a story of intricate design and intentional details. State-of-the-art labs and expansive classrooms offering hands-on experiences that push the boundaries of electrical training all made possible by the IBEW members and NECA contractors. The Columbia Basin Electrical Training Alliance building is a huge improvement over the old building and it's going to allow much more room for more apprentices to be trained. There's going to be much more lab space, better labs, more opportunities for people to get hands-on experience. In this project we did uh, the low voltage scope of work, all of the audio video, any kind of speakers, camera systems, access control systems, fire alarm system. We put up all the projectors, we programmed all of the audio video switches. The new facility, Columbia Basin Electrical Training Alliance, will not only be up to the standards with all the new technologies, but it will also afford us the ability to train the next skilled workforce. It allows us to have all of the new technologies and all the green energy availability. Uh, currently, we're gonna use solar as a, not only a training piece, but as a functional piece on the building. The new technology inside the building allows us to move forward. With the enduring support of NECA and the IBEW, the Columbia Basin Electrical Training Alliance is poised to shape the next generation of skilled electricians. This facility will equip them with cutting edge skills, prepare them to embrace new technologies, and inspire them to lead the industry with innovation and integrity. When I went through the apprenticeship, there wasn't the amount of work that there is now. There is an abundance of work right now. I think there's a lot of pride in anybody who has their fingerprints on that build. You know, we talk about the people that actually built it, the wiremen, the apprentices, and there's not a person in this local that's not proud of this facility. 